Hi everyone, it's Vicky here from OT and today we're going to have some fun with lids. So this is a really easy activity to work on lots of skills that you're going to need in everyday living, so when managing self-care tasks, opening and closing bottles, containers and particularly in the kitchen where we need to open a lot of different containers of different sizes and shapes. So all you need to do is look around the house, find some different containers, um, look in the recycle bin. Um, what we're looking for is containers of all different sizes and shapes with different types of lids and openings so that it makes it more fun and more challenging. Also to add to the fun, we've also got some different objects or items that we can place into the containers. Um, so here I've just got some little toys, but it may be that you put some tasty treats or something like that in the containers um, so there's that motivation to get into that container to get the item out. So we're just going to pop them in. And in they go. Just put a few in some of the containers just to show you how this is going to work. So this is how you would set it up before. In they go. So you could sort of time this activity to make it a bit of a race to speed up um, some of those skills, but really we're working on fine motor skills, gross motor skills, um, coordination, hand-eye coordination. So we're just going to open up the items and out they come. So as you can see, they're all a bit different. We've got a square shape here, which makes it a little bit harder to get open. These ones, these have got the useful tab, so it's identifying what might be helpful on the lid to help get that off. Now it comes. And we've got one with a really big round lid here, which makes it a bit harder to grip and turn to get it open. We're also working on pouring skills here to get the item out, so that's quite hard to get my hand in there, so that's a good exercise as well. And then we've got this tricky one here that requires quite a lot of grip strength and fine motor skill there. Out comes the item. And then we've got a few other examples. I haven't put items in here, but different types of lids, different textures. That's what we're looking for. This is a flipped lid, too small to put something in, but it's still a really good practice of opening those types of lids. So play with this, have fun, and let us know how you get on. Bye.